round one, and when you have what looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler, it doesn't always play out that way, but given what these fighters said to us on Thursday, the game plans seem pretty clear. They're very clear game plans, but which one of them is able to implement the game plan most effectively? The grappler will try to get forward, get close, try to secure takedowns. He's even double leg shot. Oh, massive slam. That'll change the complexion of this one. Gasolum's got an arm, looks like he's trying to lock up a Kimura. And this might just be a matter of time. <laughs> Somehow stays in the fight. Side control now, and certainly I would think more offensive options for the bottom fighter than in half guard. Absolutely more offensive options, because now you can just start to get away. You can just go to a wrestling stand-up. Get to your knees, close your hands, don't allow him to get his hooks in, right? Really be aware of the hooks. Oh! Use hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Man, these guys are throwing back and forth. Huge shots there. And he oh. comes through with a big knee. Oh, he lands another huge knee. How much more can he take? Oh, that's a big right hand there from Game Brad. Boxing fundamentals, certainly not an issue for this guy. Very tight. He's as sound as they come, right? A lot of times you see a guy that comes from a street fighting background. Oh, beautiful jump with the ankle pick to get him down. Now we'll see where he chooses to go from here. Got the ankle pick. Let's see how he advances in this position. Oh, yeah. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Game Brad. Beautiful right hand over the top. The ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you've got to be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and train down big strikes in your form. Oh, big knee. Oh, big knee! Good movement by him here on the ground. He really is a master of these transitions. He is a master of movement on the ground. You never know where he's going to be. Single collar tie now. Big that knee, knee lands there. That knee hurt him. Oh! And a knee. Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the, the punches and everything landing. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Oh, wow! Head kick! Oh, man. Oh, damaging knee to the head! And he oh, comes nice through with a big knee. Oh, big knee! All right, DC, here we go with the start of our second round. Jorge Gamebred Masvidal against that man, Kelvin Gaston. Nice, sneaky head kick. Oh, straight right. Shot a double leg. Oh, nice slam as he gets him to the canvas. Exactly what he needed. Back to the feet now. Slips the shot. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Not there. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, massive kick. Didn't see that one coming. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Taken down here by Gamebrook. Oh, and he's back up again. Pretty good series of knees. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. Quick entry here. <laughs> nice single leg entry. Rotates the hand outside to a high cross. Oh. Big slam takedown. That was beautiful. Game break gets back up again. Nicely done. Oh! Oh, he's wrong. Of knees in the clinch. A lot of these going right to the head. 
We'll see if he can close the show from here. And he's throwing everyone with the idea to finish the fight. Oh! Oh! Very soon. Back to the feet. Now, more often than not, when he has struck, he has landed 86 total strikes and now landed for Jorge Mosca. In terms of the efficiency, landing with 84% accuracy here. Oh, man, yeah. look at that. Victor perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. Nice punch by Gaston. He's going to try to take him down. There you go. Slams him to the ground. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You got to figure out a way to get back to your feet. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom fight. All right, so there's the horn. Let us now look back at some of the action in that round, DC. And he had his takedown game going early and off. Yeah, he had it going great. I mean, he did a great job of finding his entries, rushing to his finishes before his opponent could react and defend him. He should be very proud of the work he did over the course of that last round. Third round underway. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, big knee there. Gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout.